Yes! Yes, honey. So you guys, come on, lighting. Let's get it together. So you guys, what's popping? What's what the fuck? Hold on. God, the fuck. So you guys, what's poppin', what's good, what's up? You guys, I haven't done like a real good sit down video in like a while. Since I gotta show y'all every bit of this 2000, okay? You guys should get on my vlogging channel because that's where I got everything going down. When your sis was over here all across the United States, I was vlogging it. So definitely go over to my vlogging channel because that'll help you keep up with what your sis is doing, okay? I know y'all looking at my outfit and be like, girl, you so extra, but at the end of the day, you guys know I'm always like this, number one. But this is my 2000s creation. You guys know that Forever 21 came out with a baby fat collaboration. I was so hyped for it, you guys. And then when I got on the website, <laughs> I'm not gonna lie, your sis was a little disappointed because I love Baby Fat and I feel like they're like with a multi-billionaire company, so they could have did like way, way more. But I'm not gonna lie, I, I'm still for the old, what is it, the traditional, just a slap a logo on a t-shirt type look. I am for that because that is kind of what Baby Fat used to do, just throw it on something. But I just wanted it to be a little bit more jazzed up. So first starting off, I'm not even gonna lie you guys, it's pretty much a little basic. The only thing I can say is that the prints on it have pulled me back into that old school, like this is true to Baby Fat look. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to go ahead and try these pieces on that I actually have in here because this is a lot. It's a lot. It's a lot. I have, a, well, it's not really even a lot, bitch. Also, before we get into this video, I definitely want to let you guys know a way that you can earn some quick cash and gift cards. You guys can play games, shop online, take online surveys, a bunch of stuff if you guys go ahead and sign up with Swagbucks. Now, if you click the link in the bio, you guys, it'll take you right over there and you can also get a $5 bonus for signing up with your girl Glamazon Tay. Now, this is an easy way to make some quick cash because y'all always asking me, Tay, how can I make some monies at home doing nothing? How can I make some monies doing a little to no effort? Sis, this is a way. You guys know I'm always rapping for the broke and bougie and sis even though your girl's elevated a little bit i'm still on my broke and bougie tip okay so know me click my link in the description so you can get a five dollar bonus when you sign up with your first survey and also you guys i definitely want to thank swag bucks for sponsoring this video okay so let's just start it off number one i ended up getting this first baby fat top I ended up getting this first one when I was in New York City in Times Square. So when I was in Times Square, I was like, oh, bitch, that's baby bat. Let me get it. Let me grab her. Now, I really do like this one. I'm not going to lie. And I'm going to tell you why I like it. And it's more of a sentimental value because when I had my first baby fat jacket, it was white. It had the same exact diamond outline on the back. It was humongous. And I just thought I was the thing, honey. Girl, I just was feeling myself, okay? I was feeling myself. But I paired it really, really cute. Like I said, it's a basic t-shirt. Now, I'm not going to lie. I like the way baby fit baby tees fit because with me I like to wear white t-shirts I like to wear a black or a basic t-shirt but instead of it just being a regular t-shirt I like it to be like a very snug tight fit now I end up getting this in a size small the price on it I believe was like $19 or something let me let me let me check her sis let me check her oh no it was $17.90 I feel like it's a cute shirt but I feel like it also was pretty basic um if I looked at it I would think it was pretty vintage I'm not against it I just know that it's not something that screams out baby fat baby fat baby fat baby fat I just kind of wanted it from what I got, you know? OD over the top. But I just feel like it would have been a part of like a 2000 Baby Fat collection because back in the day, their shirts was just regular shirts and then it had like a logo on it with the diamonds. I had the jacket, so I know. But I don't know. I just expected a little more. Like, okay. Mm. Mm. So with this, I kept it cute and simple or whatever. I ended up wearing these like white shorts and then now you got the Baby Fat top on with like the Baby Fat ensemble. And I wish it was diamonds on my bandana, but it's from like the hair store, so it don't got no damn diamonds. No me. Y'all can't even see this. This is a fail. <laughs> Girl, can y'all see that? Y'all gonna see it when I'm editing, but anyway. So I think it's a cute little vibe, but I think it's cute because it looks fresh. Like anytime somebody wear white, it looks fresh. Tap, 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 tap. Mm. Yes. Yes, honey. Ooh, ooh, ooh. I feel like all these clothes is like twerk worthy though because girl, they all spandex. 
But I bought these shorts on my own from like Forever 21. And I think it was only like four or five dollars. But I feel like it's off on the whites. Like this is a creamy white, this is a white white, and I think this is like a winter white or something like that. But something simple for the girls, something simple for the booze. But I feel like it's still giving cute, still a vibe. So let me know what you guys think about it. Let me know. Comment below. I think this one is cute though. I would wear this with like some cute sneakers and just be out in these streets. Be out in these streets. I don't know. This outfit just made me want to twerk. It just made me want to twerk. Yes, move your body like a snake, ma. To the break, ma. Okay, so next I ended up getting a set, which I was really, really proud of because, sis, I didn't know if I was going to be able to get a set or not. So I ended up getting this one. It's a nice little leopard set. Now, I'm going to start with the top, talking about the top. Now, pretty much with the top, you guys can see, it has, like, the little logo on it. It's in the gold foil. This is nothing out of the ordinary. And I actually believe I already have a set that's similar to this with this. So, hey. I'm just letting you know, I'm just being honest. I don't feel like it's too out there. I feel like it's pretty basic. I feel like it fits pretty good with me. I think I got, let me check everything, cause girl, a bitch be tripping. I ended up getting the top and a small and a bottoms and a medium. And with me, I'm normally a medium large. So I don't know if I lost weight or I don't know if their sizing is off, but everything seems like it's supposed to fit baby-ish, give or take baby fat okay like it's not too crazy it has baby fat on it so of course it's giving me that vintage ish tease because we all know we associate baby fat with the 2000s but other than that it's not really crazy the stretch on is good um you see it fits on my body really nice it has my butt looking real pokey but that's the same as if i was to go buy a regular pair of legging shorts with a cami that's the right size so it's not nothing too crazy i really feel like they kept it pretty simple as you guys can tell and the shirt is 14.90 and the bottoms is 17.90 so i mean the price point isn't too bad i feel like that's the same as if you were to buy from fashion nova or well, a little bit cheaper than fashion nova and the other little instagram boutiques out here but it just isn't like a crazy crazy type collection like i feel like when i hear baby fat mixing with the new millennium i want it to be like over the top i'm expecting colors i'm expecting baby fat all over diamonds extra just giving me what baby fat used to give because back in the day you guys know baby fat was on point with like their marketing their ads like i used to take their damn little ads out the magazine honey and hang them up on my wall so i was all for that marketing especially with what is it mean and the little baby girl so i was really into it i just expected so much more okay you guys so i paired this one up okay because i had to style it up because you guys know it was pretty much basic it was a tank and some damn legged shorts honey but i feel like i came through with a good look for you i got some good octavia bamboo hoop earrings even though y'all probably don't know who that is and this is actually from the cardi b collection so the last time i did something that was like a basic retail store it was the cardi b collection with fashion nova so this jacket kind of went with the look so i went ahead says am i giving am i giving giving a vibe am i giving jenny for the vlog come get me up but yes i feel like this is giving a look i paired it really cute though well i had a little help i'm about to say she ain't paying shit <laughs> <laughs> I don't know how big. In 2000s, but it's like really early 2000s. But sis, check me out. Check me out. I feel like with this collection, if you want to make it work, you're going to have to like pair it up with some dope ass stuff. Because if you just try to come out the house on some basic, sis, it's probably going to look like you was left in the 2000s and you ain't going to look as cute as you would look in the millennial. You never see somebody that they got some Darion pants on. You're like, bitch, where you got some Darion pants on from? Like, sis, what's going on? Like, that's what this will give. But I feel like this is cute. This is cute. It's a vibe. It's alive. And my booty. Give it thickums. Thick mommy. Girl, I'm returning as soon as this trial haul is over, bitch. <laughs> <laughs> So this one, I wasn't really opposed to it. I kind of actually was liking it because it reminded me of like some old school baby fat. I feel like it was a little bit more effort put into these two pieces versus everything else. So I'm gonna just be honest. Now with this one, it's like this little pink foil and it has a little crown. And this actually, girl, that actually look like the Darion symbol if you want to be 100% honest. <laughs> but it's this like tube top cami type and then it's like the matching skirt to go with it. So... Let's get into the tees, honey. Now, with both of these pieces, I ended up getting them in a size medium. 
This one actually fits a little bit bigger than I thought it was gonna fit, so you know. But it has a really good stretch on it. It seems like it's doubled, so it's pretty thick. It's not like a cheap kind, so I'm gonna just throw it out there. It's not like cheapy, just one layer. It's actually like double layered, so it's like one layer and then an inside lining, so they actually did take care for that. But it does have baby fat all over. This was more of one of the ones I said, like they've put more creativity into it. It seemed like it's a little bit more than the other pieces of the collection, because everything else was given pretty black like you know I'm just being honest it was $14.90 and the skirt I believe is $17.90 and then it's just pretty much a skirt that mimics the same look so with me in this collection I feel like if I wasn't so into with the 2000s and doing like a styling it type of thing this probably would have got real boring real quick but I feel like I feel like I'm gonna give Kimora another chance so if Kimora want to come through and do another collection I will give her another chance but I really do wish like they put more into it like I feel like it's so much money out there for this freaking collaboration like girl we could have been out here looking like <sighs> baby fat themselves like I mean I don't know like I just feel like I wanted more I just wanted more like put me on a creative direction team because sis I got some ideas and y'all know I've been coming through that fast so period this is the one outfit that I have on the little pink bubblegum type of look and I wanted to make this like really like baby girlish like baby doll girl I'm feeling this it's cute on the fit but like I said it's pretty basic it's not really too much going on here it's just like a basic type of cami with a matching skirt set like style it it wouldn't have been like that dope but I feel like this is still giving me that millennium type of look like girl Call me up on my cell phone, okay? With my, especially my little fun, so sis, yes. I'm giving a vibe. I'm giving a look. Woo! Very thick quality. So see if you get it. It ain't gonna be cheap, but it's just gonna be basic and good quality pretty much. So pretty much giving me like wholesale logo type vibes. Wholesale logo type vibes. Sorry, Kamora, but that's what it's giving. <laughs> We got this top, um, you guys see it's like one of those type of tops where it's like it swoops and it actually has baby fat on it. Now I can appreciate the fact that this is actually embroidered and not like steam, what is it, steam pressed or whatever you call it where it's like pressed onto it. This is actually embroidered. So I can appreciate the fact of that. This is $14.90 and it's a size medium. I will say they didn't make the price point too crazy. Like even though it's pretty basic, it's not like a crazy price because girl, if they had said $25, $30, I might have left this on the shelf, okay? But I do think that I like that style of cut with the or mouth. So it does give me like that old retro vibe, but I'm gonna be honest, that style is already kind of low key coming back. So it wasn't really that hard for, it's not like a odd piece that you'll never see with that type of cut. But at the same point, it's not, it's not giving what I want to say it's not giving me like this is so creative I can't find this nowhere else like oh my god this is it it's lit like it's not giving me that you know so this is the next one I tried to pair it up like really cute see so basically I got my little cowboy hat because you guys know baby fat is all about like prints and stuff so I got this cowboy hat and then I got the baby fat top on of course and I got like a little diamond belt it actually is a necklace but I made it into a belt and this is the vibe I got. I got my silver hoops in too. So sis, out to these streets, yes. Twerk. I got them horses in the back. I don't know the rest of the song, y'all. This is cute though. Like I feel like I'm giving such a look. I'm serving. I feel like I styled it really cute or whatever. So let me know what you guys think. I feel like it was the cutest thing though. I got my diamonds on. I feel like my necklaces really don't go with it. So let me like tuck them away. Let me tuck them away. Y'all probably wouldn't even pay attention to them for real, bro. Yes! Yes, honey! Oh my god, y'all, it feels so good to be back doing my trial hauls, doing them like I normally do. Getting back to the basics with y'all, because y'all know y'all my bitches enough with y'all. It'll be a vibe, especially because baby fat's across it. But you just can't be out in these streets with this just basic top on and some jeans. I'm sorry, because it's just not gonna give, okay? Ooh. Ooh. Yes, honey, with the horses in the back. Horse strings attached. <laughs> and then last but not least, we got this 
I like this shirt because it gives me that baby ish vibe that I was telling you guys I love leopard you guys know I always wear like animal prints so that's like my ting and then it has the little press on it but this one is a little bit more extra it has like it black but then you see it's gold outlined so of course I could appreciate that a little bit more be fat in a new millennium like what what's going on Well, I guess so. It's the 2000s, so that was like 20 something years ago. Girl, I don't even know. I'm, I'm done. <laughs> I'm done. This is like Forever 21 Men's, but they from like a long time ago. And then I got the Baby Fat shirt. So I try to be like real baggy, real not matchy, but it matches, but on some sleek type stuff. It's a vibe. It's a look. Really popping. Girl, my chair. But I feel like if I wanted to go to the party and twerk in these jeans I definitely could so this is a real chill fit like I feel like it's it's a look I like it I normally don't go for the chill look but the chill look is working for this so I'm feeling it okay but like I said I love the way the shirt fits so the shirt fits really really good so I'm feeling the shirt and it also is giving like baby doll type baby girl like baggy 2000s 2000s honey I'm feeling this okay and it's giving me like real cutesy like I'm out in these streets, like I said, a better get it. It's still basic, bitch. It's still basic. Yes! <laughs> no, honey. Check me out. Baby fat mommy, baby fat queen, baby fat baby. Pretty much kept it on the safe side with this collection. I didn't hate the collection, but I also expected way more from the collection. And I seen like not that many YouTubers reviewed it, which I can understand why, because sis, it really wasn't much to review. But at the same point, if you just want to see somebody wear it on and, girl, you hear from my personality, hey, it's lit. But if you really wanted to, like, buy the collection, girl, it wasn't, like, all that. Like, it, it was, like, cute, but they, they kept it cute. They didn't keep it risky. They didn't keep it, like, too out there. They kept it cute and basic, meaning that you can't do too much negativity on it all you can basically say is it wasn't much to it and then it was only one more piece that i really really wanted to get was like the floor type of set but girl i couldn't even i couldn't find it nowhere like in new york i couldn't find it la i couldn't find it so if i went to both of those places and couldn't find it i'm pretty much saying that i don't think that they either didn't have a lot of those or they didn't send it out to a lot of places i mean i'm just being honest so that's pretty much what I got from it. But I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like I said, I miss doing my old type of just trial hauls. Just me and my camera. No camera guy. No team. No nothing. I kind of miss just getting back in front of the camera. Just sitting down. So I'm going to start incorporating these in a little bit more. Because you guys know I've been taking a break. Y'all been digging in my butt. And now I'm back. And I'm going to try to do better. So I'm going to see you guys in my next video. Don't forget to comment, like, and subscribe. And definitely don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. And I'll see you guys in my next one. Mwah. See ya.